Hello, my name is LJ and I'm a service technician with Hargrave Communication and I will be going over the self-insulation kit that you will receive in the mail installing a digital adapter. Inside the self-insulation kit you will receive the adapter instructions, the cable, the digital adapter, digital adapter remote, your HDMI cable, your power cable, and your IR sensor and also the manual for your remote. That includes everything that's installed in your installation kit. For safety reasons, you want to make sure all the power cords to your electronic devices are unplugged before you install your digital adapter. Okay, once you've taken your digital adapter out of your box, on the back of the adapter you will find certain ports. Port 1 is cable TV in. This is where you're going to find the existing cable wire from the wall and screw it in. Port two will be cable TV out. This will go to your TV that you will actually screw into the back of your TV. Port three was IR in, infrared remote sensor. Port four is HDMI cable for high definition TV. And then you actually have the port for your power. On the back of your digital adapter, you will find a switch channel three or channel four. This must match what your TV is on to receive the program. Once you've taken your digital adapter out of the self-insulation kit, you will need to find your existing coaxial cable coming from the wall and plug it into port one behind your DTA. Step two will actually take the coaxial cable and go from cable TV out and this will go to the cable TV in to your TV. Step three will take your IR sensor, plug that in. Step four will be the power, making sure you plug the other end into power. For our customers who receive high definition channels, you will want to use your HDMI cable that came with your self insulation kit. You need to take one end and insert it into the port and insert the other end behind your TV. For the customer who would like to mount their digital adapter behind the TV, you must use the Velcro that came in your installation kit and the IR sensor. It must be line of sight with the remote. Please refer to the manual to program your remote to the TV. And with your digital adapter remote, the batteries are included. That concludes your self-installation process of the digital adapter. If you have any questions, please contact Hargrave on the number below.